All right, good morning from Disney's Typhoon Lagoon. Uh, park opens at 10. We pulled in around 9.30, 9.35. Uh, parking was a breeze. Took a nice little photo in front and uh, scanned in. We did pre-purchase our tickets on the uh, app itself. Uh, so we were able to bypass the line. Just gonna show you Turn guys around. like Still where our you in. plan to set up shop Come for on. the day is gonna be over here. This is like the kitty area, the splash pad. Um, we entered this way, and now we're in holding like right over here. So we're gonna take a left, kind of. What? Why would you? You need to stay buckled there. in. There's too many people. But I just think like sitting over here will probably be best for Paxton. Yeah, that one looks fun. All right, we got our seats under the Palapa. It was a mad dash. Thousands of people just running, literally, trying to find seats under umbrellas, Palapas. We're trying to find a good location. We set up shop here in the kitty splash pad area because I think that's where Paxton is going to spend most of his time. I'm just uh, and it'll be a good base for us. So we've got, uh, we didn't get front row, but we do have second row, five or six seats right in the center. So we should be in good shape. This is the largest wave pool in North America, I think, from what I've read. Look at the size of this thing. Huge. So cool. Are you kidding me, guys? Look at this. You see the size of that first wave? What? Look at that. Okay, first up, Gangplank Falls, a uh, family raft with no height restriction. Uh, so it says there's a five minute wait. Uh, it's been a little over five, but you're in the shade uh, most of the time, and uh, you got sprinklers shooting off at you. And then now, at this point of the line, you're kind of standing in the water. You're waiting for a tube. And then you gotta carry the two about that way. When you don't want the ocean? No. We're not going in the ocean.
There's another one. Guys, we've got all kinds of rope droppers today. <laughs> These guys are just waiting for the bar to open. not get a cabana and I'm really kicking myself right now we have this whole little section over here that is cabanas um, when I looked online all the cabanas that they showed were sandy and I hate sand especially with the baby and we ended up in a sandy spot anyways so I wish I just got a cabana those are not sandy I don't know if you can request or not um, but there's like a very limited shade here as far as seating. So if shade is important to you, if you're coming with anyone that's elderly or small children, either like bring your own umbrella. I see a lot of people who brought umbrellas that kind of tie to their chairs, which is super smart. You can tell that they are water park pros. Um, I'll kind of show you over here, but the umbrellas are very, very scarce. If you can see them, there's only like a couple. And depending on the time of day, like you're not guaranteed shade with an umbrella. So bring your own umbrella or get a cabana. would not hold on to the strap so they kicked them off the ride so doing uh, crush and gusher now with Nolan actually gonna stay behind with him and Camden does not want to go on it all right a little bit of a wait uh, there's three options to choose from uh, and I think we chose banana blaster uh, so a little bit of a wait but it is okay we're in the shade so we are doing banana blaster, there is pineapple plunger, and then there's coconut crusher. It's a uh, fruit produce stand uh, if you haven't picked up on it yet.
over to Low Tide Blues for a quick drink. And look at this cup. What an incredible souvenir cup. This is fantastic. Okay, next up, Lazy River. Okay, guys. Way to go. That's a big waterfall, a big cave. for a nap we went to the bathroom but first we're gonna go check out the first mountain grotto this looks incredible i'm getting some seven dwarfs mine train vibes this is cool and through the forgotten grotto is more of a walkway uh, i was hoping for some sort of uh pool we'll see where this takes us okay the adventure continues typhoon boat works so cool. The designing of this place is just it's second really to none. Good. I mean, they are really good. Every little nook and cranny, everything is just. I mean, it's Disney. What do you expect? This is uh, another cabana. I don't see a number on it though. I wonder how you can ask for cabanas that are not sandy. That's a good point. All right, we are at Happy Landings Ice Cream. We are all gonna get a round of ice cream. Paxton is sleeping. Uh, has a nice little cloudy overcast and uh, it's about 85 90 degrees today. This place is just absolutely packed. Oh, here comes another wave. You guys can see it. Wow. Brownie Sunday coming right up. Actually, got her pineapple upside down pineapple one. Boys got the brownie one as well. This thing looks fantastic. Oh, we're trying to get in a little closer to catch the waves. I don't know if I'm going to make this one. Come on, we'll hold hands. <laughs> no, right here. No, right here. Right here. Stand then. Right there, right here. Let's see if he comes. You just suck up a fear pressure. Come on. Right here. Just come right here. There he comes. All right, look, right here's fine. All right, let's see if it's coming. Oh, no. the 
to try to get a little deeper, really get a full experience. Cam said he'd be okay in the shallow end. I have no idea where Nolan is. I need to try to find him. Here it is. Here we go. I don't know where he is. After time, oh, I found him. Nolan. Me and Camden are over here. Over here. Hi. I'm a part of this video. Hi. You having fun? Yeah. You like this? Yes. What's your favorite part? This. Okay. Poor Camden's been sitting over here waiting for me. Look at him waving. Where? Already pressed the button, so now you're going to record, okay? Okay, here, you can record facing out or you can face yourself, whatever you want. before but this when the first wave hits it's crazy it's not even like a wave it really is like a typhoon wave how they do that it's wild it's the biggest wave pool in North America it's the biggest wave pool in North America oh I didn't know that I don't think that's true <laughs> don't think that's a fact That's not scary. This isn't a scary, right? Come on me. Come on me. Where's it not scary? Packy, show me your boo boo. Show mommy your boo boo. Hey, Packy, show mommy your boo boo. Oh, Packy got a boo boo on his eyebrow. Splash Wouldn't be a vacation without Paxson getting hurt. Where's it gonna come? Big waves, Big on, the waves top. on the top. Tell Dad. 
Daddy, that was me. Say, Mommy, did you get the picture? I didn't catch it on camera, but uh, something happened over there in that corner where the lifeguard is. And he jumped in so fast to, to pick someone up. And then the whole wave pool just... Yeah, that last big wave took someone out and that lifeguard, he was fast. He, he jumped right in all the way from up top over there. He pulled that kid up. And then uh, as soon as he climbed back up there, the whole wave pool just started cheering, clapping. They're just doing another sweep right now, but that was pretty impressive. We are heading out and before we leave we're have hopping into Singapore South. Check to see if there's any nice souvenirs. Ashley is a sucker for a good souvenir store, so let's head on in. Oh we were just talking about how you needed new uh, flip flops. I know. I wanted what to do buy you think? them the other day. I'm gonna buy them. Oh, they have those right there in the back. Perfect. They're 11. What one's behind those? Oh, great. All right, Nels. Nels, did you have fun today? Nolan, move your foot. Did you have fun today? Yeah. We got Billabong and. Salt life. Oh, I like that. Disney tank top. Like Disney just never makes enough tank tops. Towels. Uh, let's head out. I'm sure Ashley will be yelling. Let's go. Oh, this one is fire. Look at this thing. Where's my goofy story? Fans at. This thing's nice. Good Hollywood Studios shirt. It's weird that they have a towel return box here when they don't offer towels. They only offer towels if you're an on site guest. Oh. We are not this Oh, uh, okay. Got it. Uh -huh. go. Alright, there is a after hours H2O glow party tonight which guests can enter at four and the party does it start at seven or eight eight, eight and it runs till ten I think so. nice I, almost I don't think that's very uh child friendly i would say i mean you could it's not no, like it it's is. it definitely is but yeah. Oh, cool. And, uh, I just felt like with the time, since it technically starts at 8, it was kind of late for Paxton. And then with it being so hot today, if we did like pool all day, I just didn't think he would be able to hang and then we would be like split the whole night. So. But maybe next time. Maybe next time. Alright, back to the car. Alright guys, we are headed back to the hotel in a twist of feet. As soon as we got in the car, I said, where is my GoPro 
uh, fanny pack had my microphone, my earpods, tons of stuff in there. Wasn't in the car, had to run all the way back to our chairs, which was like the complete opposite end of the water park where the uh, entrance was. Finally got down there and covered up by two blue life vests was the bag. This has happened before. At Be Our Guest. Guys, staying off site is for the It's not easy. Yeah, we had a uh, 25 minute drive. We're still driving. If there's driving. no traffic, it would be, how much was it, 11 minutes this no, morning? No, 15 minutes. Yeah, not even 15 minutes. But with traffic, oh my goodness, it's like 25, 30 minutes. Yeah. So we're going to head back to the room and uh, shower and change and eat some leftovers and then uh, take an afternoon stroll later on tonight. Maybe get some ice cream again. We'll see. Oh, I wanted a funnel cake today. I wanted those mini donuts that everyone was talking about. Oh, me and Camden were looking for the funnel cakes. Yes, Packy, you can shower first. What? Oh, my here. Let's get out. And this is why you get a one bedroom villa with a full kitchen. Tonight's dinner is leftovers. French fries for Paxton, shrimp and chicken and mac and cheese for Camden. Got some steak, little main pot stickers for mom and dad. Some chicken and some more lo mein, cauliflower, uh, spicy cauliflower bites, coconut shrimp, and uh, chicken quesadillas. We are good to go. Dinner is served. Okay, we were getting ready to leave, but Mother Nature had other plans. It is pouring. Paxton, you want to come show them your boo boo? Yeah, yeah. Paxton got her at the splash pad. Show them your eye. You got to come closer, you're too far away. Let's see. The other eye. Turn this way. Yeah, there it is. See that eyebrow? I already took a picture. Yeah, I'm okay. Alright, just a couple tips um, for anyone going to a water park. We had a great time at Typhoon Lagoon today. Um, <clears throat> but with that being said, definitely bring water shoes, especially if you have like toddlers. The water's hot, even though they do have sprayers on the ground um midday it gets really really hot so i would recommend water shoes at least for babies or toddlers um, we had to carry paxton a lot of the time today because the ground was just so hot for him um i know i said it before while we were there but i also really do recommend getting a cabana or renting the umbrellas or bringing your own umbrella um there's just minimal shade at Typhoon Lagoon, almost next to nothing. Um, we were lucky enough that we got some shade this morning, but if you don't rope drop it, you won't find any. And a day like today, it was pretty hot and brutal out. So um, I guess like plan accordingly and um, definitely do the refillable cup. So if you have the resort refillable mug, that one won't work at Typhoon Lagoon. Um, but they do have one, I think it was $12.99 for the day, $8.50 if you want to reactivate it for another day. Um, so I do recommend the refillable mug there, and it's super easy. They have stations everywhere to refill them. Um, also, like Paul, did you tell them about your beer? <laughs> so Paul bought beer this afternoon, and he was like, oh, look at this really cool cup it comes in. And I was like, oh, that is neat. Um, and then so he got a couple more beers throughout the day. And when he was on pretty much his last beer, the bartender was like, oh, did you know that if you have 
that cup. Oh, save that cup because you'll get a four dollar discount on every beer thereafter. So now we have multiple cups. Never received the discount. So just know that. Um, I guess the more you know. We haven't been to a water park since before Paxton. Um, so lesson learned there. But now we have a whole bunch of cool new cups, Paul. Um, I do recommend to kind of hit the parks the way that we did. We tried to do as many slides as we could in the morning or as whatever slides we wanted to do. We didn't hit all of them, but we did do a lot of them. Um, so I would recommend to do your slides in the morning and then kind of do all the things that don't have a wait in the afternoon, like the Lazy River. And the kids absolutely loved that tidal wave pool. So they spent a lot of time there. And then also just like the splash pad for the baby. Um, so that's a huge tip. And then also by like three o'clock, the park just cleared out. I'm not sure if it was just because of today and they have H2O glow nights tonight um, or what it was, but I think it's probably pretty typical that the park thins out around three o'clock and there was no wait, like maybe five minutes on everything around three and after three. So it would definitely either come early or come late, kind of one or the other. And then last tip, um, just going back to the minimal shade, I would bring sun shirts, especially for children, even if they fight you on it and they don't want to wear them or they don't usually wear them bring them just in case at least for your water park day um, so we are heading back now to the boardwalk area I'm gonna grab some caramel apples hit the bakery maybe watch the Epcot fireworks um, we'll see probably just do some shopping and explore but we are stuck in traffic yet again um, so when we are at Marriott Grand Vista, I love it and I don't miss, I don't miss Disney at all when I'm there. I love that bubble. That's its own little bubble in itself. Um, but the commute is, what do you think about the commute? Hate it. Not a fan. Do not recommend. 10 out of 10. Do not recommend. Like I said, the GPS on a good day is 10 minutes, but we all know traffic in Orlando is pretty heavy, so it's a good... You just, you know going into it that you're going to hit it, it's fine, you know, but... Just got to set realistic expectations, yeah. I guess. So you get the space in the room and the kitchen and, you know... The space is awesome. Like I said, when we're there, we love it. The pools are great, the food is great, all the on-site amenities are great. The space, the room is beautiful. It's a Marriott vacation club, so it's it's up to Marriott standards. It's a really nice place. Um, and we're so lucky that we can trade in there with our timeshare. It's just when you're accustomed to staying on Disney property, it can be an adjustment. So, finally moving. Okay, next up, Skyliner. Welcome aboard, Islanders. You are on the Disney Skyliner at Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort. We're flying to Disney's yes, Riviera Mom. Resort with continuing really? flights to Epcot. Do one more because the lighting's good. One, two, three, cheese! Hold on.
got some renovations going on. I've always wanted a room facing the boardwalk. The last of it. So I can come in there and stay. No, but it's 21 plus. <laughs> well, I could just say it's um, to, to say, to say it's really tough. You need to be 21 plus to go in there. So? Alright. One of Ashley's favorite gift shops. I don't remember the last time she's ever bought something from this store, but this is one of her favorites. Oh, the air conditioning feels so nice in here. Nice bathing suit. Look at this thing. Beach towels, thirty dollars. Tommy Bahama, one hundred and twenty. We did finds. I like the Haunted Mansion one. Oh, is that? Um, Would you like a basket? This looks very retro. It's a retro shirt, huh? Oh, look at this. Mm, Ashley, 4th of July. What do you guys think? 4th of July shirt? $30. Well, I can't turn it. Somebody out there. Love the boardwalk swag. This ornament looks nice. Do we have the boardwalk? Abracadabra. Looks nice. Thirty five. people. Got a caramel apple over here. Is that what we're looking for? Do you want that one? Do you guys want that one? That one's safe for you. What, babe? The peanut butter cookies here are so good. Just in time for a show. Uh, a little backstory. There's uh, all of the artists and uh, most impressive trick we do in the whole show. It's also the quickest, so pay close attention. But it took six months of planning, another six months of rehearsals. Uh, there were several injuries. All of those injuries were emotional. And we're still carrying those today. So we're about to debut that trick right now. Thank you for laughing at my emotional thing. Yeah. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay. You still remember it, right? Uh, I think so. Okay. Thank you! Thank you! Yes! All right. Looks like some missed the trick. Don't worry. We're going to do it again, but this time, let's pretend like we're not Disney Plus, and, and we can see you. Hey, you guys know, you know how else we're out like Disney Plus? Our rates don't go up. What, you think I wouldn't make fun of the place that employs me? Yeah, our rates can't go up, but there's inflation. Anyway. Here we go. We're gonna try that again. 
and the crowd goes wild! All right, here we go, let's sing it up a notch. All right. Wow. Don't break eye contact with me. Don't break eye contact. All right, check it. Boom. Ha! Wow. Thank you. Whoa! 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 Whoa. Whoa. Oh, there, there we go. go. All right, here we go. All right, folks, this is the uh, two-man six-pin pattern. Yeah. Thank you. No, I know. You're welcome. It's boring. We're gonna do some tricks. I'm gonna call the name of the tricks so you guys can go home, Google them, and see what they're supposed to look like. Yeah. All, right. All right. So this right here is called the double. Oh! Oh, I like that. Hey, if you do jigs, can I do Lucky Charms? <laughs> you guys pick this. Yeah, all right, I'm gonna do the same thing. Hey, look at that. This next one is called Out of Batteries. Gotta change those? Yep, all right, and now this next trick is called Difficult because I'm over 40. Ah! Oh. <laughs> this next trick is called Not Difficult because I'm under 40. It's the same trick. It's the same trick. Yeah, boo. Oh, come on. Boo for being under 40. You, everybody. What a fun show, but look at the boardwalk. The energy down here right now is just electric. This is crazy. It really is. Nothing beats the boardwalk, you know? We are heading to the Skyliner and uh, gonna catch the fireworks from there. We were gonna catch it from the bridge, but I think we're gonna try to beat the traffic. Boy, did we time this perfect. Look at that line. Okay. On the skyline, I'm back to Caribbean Beach. You can see Spaceship Earth. Let's see if we can see it better without the light. There she is. Oh, I'm so tired. All right, guys, that is going to do it. We had an absolutely uh, fantastic day at Blizzard Beach. We will definitely, no, I'm sorry, Typhoon Lagoon. Uh, we will definitely be back. It was incredible. Um, great day overall. We're able to see the boardwalk, which is our favorite area in all of Disney. Uh, we're able to catch some of the fireworks. Um, all in all, it was a good day. So relaxing day tomorrow followed by the new drone show at Disney Springs. So you guys are going to want to stay tuned for that. So thank you so much for following along. If you are new to the channel, please do not hesitate to hit the subscribe button. And uh, we will catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching and safe travels.